Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Warwick and you're watching Gas Tax, the channel that's here to help you figure out how to build your dream garage. And today, my 2020 Ford Expedition gets a light upgrade. So let's jump right into it. If you're new to the channel, thanks for stopping by. If you're a longtime subscriber, always good to have you back. Just a reminder, today's the last day to enter into win the $150 OmniWall Power Tool Organization Kit. All you gotta do is subscribe to the channel, like this video, and leave a comment, and you are automatically entered to win. Next week, I'll be announcing the winner. So guys, it is pretty windy here today, so hopefully you can hear me, but today we're talking about the light upgrade. So basically, I had a 2018 Ford Expedition Platinum that came with a great set of headlights. Then I got this FX4 package uh, 2020 Expedition, and I didn't even think about checking the headlights, but they are completely different and then I went on a 2,000 mile adventure happened to be caught in a rainstorm at night and I couldn't see anything with these lights so I knew I needed to upgrade them now looking at getting the upgraded OEM Ford lights uh, that was about two thousand dollars for each side and I was not about to spend four thousand dollars upgrading these lights so luckily I already had my winch mount on order that came with a 20 inch uh, LED bar and then two other spotlights down below. But for you guys that don't actually have this winch mount, let me tell you what I did with the fog lights, low beams and high beams. So firstly I upgraded the low beams. It's a 9005 bulb. Uh, I replaced it with a 6000 Kelvin bright white LED from Sea Light. These things run at $39.99 but right now there's a coupon on Amazon for $12 off. So that'll set you back $29.99. Alright for the high beams I also put a C light h9 bulb in there 6000 colvin and it cost me 39.99 but there is a 12 dollar coupon as well i'm not too impressed with those but you be the judge check out the video all right now moving down below to the fog lights i upgraded to an ala light bulb a h11 3000 kelvin in amber uh, ideally i wanted amber because i'm going to be driving a lot in snow i might replace these uh, lights to amber as well but right now it came with the white so i'm sticking to that those fog lights will set you back $22.98. Now I am talking about lights, so I'm going to mention the lights that came with my winch mount. The top light bar is a 20 inch single row light bar. It is pushing out 7,000 lumens and uh, it's pretty bright and nice. That's going to set you back, if you just want to buy that, $149. Now talking about the spotlights down below, these are just shy of 3,000 lumens. Uh, they are pretty good, but as I mentioned, I might be switching them out to the amber ones. Those will set you back $79.99. Now guys, this is a huge improvement over stock. Um, I'm happy with how it turned out for the most part, minus the high beams. But if you look at this image here, there's still a lot of dark area. Depending on how much off-roading I do at night, I may want to put a light bar up top or even get some extended ditch lights to see this side. So, what do you think about my light combination? Let me know in the comments below. So guys, thanks a lot for tuning in. Just a reminder, today is that last day to enter to win that October giveaway. So be sure you do that. But until next time, be sure you leave me a like, subscribe, and I'll see you then.